What's going on, everybody? It's Melbro back with Get Rich or Die, episode 20 here. And I have finally found the treasure chest after all this time. Uh, starting about $30,000. Uh, I'll, I'll give you the total once I... In editing, once I get back. I know I didn't give an exact uh, total last episode at the end, but... Eh, not a big deal, but let's see what we got. 13,334 dukes and 136762s. It's like, I do these are very lucrative, and I'm glad I spent all this time. Um, yes, I even had a collapse. Yeah, I had to dig out this giant crater. And I wound up eventually caving in. No pun intended. But, uh, and bought two levels of treasure hunter. I knew, I know I said uh, at the end of last episode that I was wanting to uh, save those for steel smithing, but I got so frustrated with the uh, find the treasure, I was, uh, I basically just said screw it. So, anyways, I uh, got Psycho Steve and wanted to say good morning to me. How are we doing, big guy? I'll give you the knife. Come here. Come on. There you go. Anyways, I'm gonna drive back over to the town and uh, and got some base building to do. So let's uh, so I'll meet you guys over there. Home sweet home. So what I'm wanting to do for base building is well, want to start. I want to do some repairs and upgrades to the pit base over there. I want to do that for preparation for tonight. I do have uh, crops to harvest. Uh, there's some stuff to do, and another big thing I want to do on this is uh, I want to start making. I want to start expanding the farm plot out. I know some people are not big fans of building episodes, but it's one of those. It's a necessary evil. So we got. 45,060 dukes as of now, which is really nice to see. Really profiting on the old flat, on the old, uh... We're only about 4% of the way there, but... Here's hoping, uh... I'm hoping to start making this a lot better... As time goes on. So, and, uh... That means getting more cotton and everything, but... So... Okay. What I first want to do is I want to start grabbing some resources, which means I gotta get a new pickaxe built because it, because mine broke in the uh, fall in the winter town. A little bit of my fault, but it's no biggie. I'm not too worried about it. So a lot of there. This is gonna be a time lapse heavy episode, guys. Uh, so no, oh, let's just begin the time lapse.
as I'm gathering resources here, I did want to bring this up with you guys, like, uh, after this series is done, like, you know, whenever it may be done, like, uh, I'm thinking about, uh, starting up a, a long-term single-player world, like, uh, because I have the co-op series, and don't get me wrong, I love playing with things, and, uh, you know, you have a lot of fun playing with them, but... The, the little twist with this uh, single player series, though, is I'm thinking about, you know, starting streaming on Twitch, and I know some of you would probably ask, uh, well, why Twitch of all things? It, and, well, it's because of uh, the new console version, it's gonna have, the, it's gonna have full-on Twitch, uh, Twitch integration, and, uh, I think it'd be fun, yo. Know, it would be a good idea right now to uh, start streaming on there while I you know, build up a little bit of an audience, get a uh, get them get it going, and having a bit of you know, it isn't like you know, that way you. Know, and the thing with the single player world is it would not be a Twitch exclusive uh, kind of thing. It's one of those uh, no, you guys. You know, I have to look into it more to make sure I can, but, uh, I didn't... I edited it down to, uh, you know, kind of edit into, like, my typical style of episodes, uh, with, you know, like you're seeing here with Get Rich or Die, so... But you begin, like, stream highlights and everything, you know, kind of, like, some funny moments and everything out of it, and... I think it'd be a good way to expand the platform a little bit, uh, you know, and expand my reach out and, you know, be able to help out uh, and get into the group. Besides, the, you know, if I get a mm, audience uh, built up on Twitch, you know, once the new console version releases, then you can, especially if I'm able to, you know, start being. Uh, I don't know their monetization uh, that well, but uh, I think it'd be fun, you know, letting you know, like you guys be able to because. You know, a Twitch monetization, it would be, uh, you'd be able to, like, uh, donate bits, I think it is. I, like I say, I have to look into it more, but it'd be, it'd be one of those you get to, you'd be able to spawn in zombies and everything, you know, screamers, or give me, like, loot chests and all this to help me out or punish me and all this, so, you know. That's kind of one of the original ideas I had with, uh, Seven Days to Die. You have an interactive series, like, with you, the viewers, and, you know, it's like, because, like, yeah, doing play, uh, doing let's, kind of these let's plays is fun and all this, you know, these challenges, but I'm just kind of like, where's the fun in having this with, uh, uh if you guys don't, inter don't get to interact with the uh, Myself personally, and I really want that from you guys. Uh, so, and uh, I don't know if I'd stream on uh, if I do uh, a YouTube stream as well. I'd it'd be one of those I prefer, you know, kind of keep it like you know, a Twitch, you know, a Twitch stream. And yes, I know, like, uh, like Twitch is not the most highly regarded platform out there, but I think it would just be fun to do this kind of thing, you know. Yeah, you know, especially be able to take advantage of them. Mod the, uh, you know, have, being able to have, like, you you guys being able to, uh, spawn zombies and all that, and be a fun little, and kind of, you know, a fun way for you guys to have, uh, you know, have an effect on the game, uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think of that. But back to the time lapse.
Okay, I'm done with the resource collecting now, so... Moving on to the base portion, more the build, uh, the base building portion, so... What I've done here is I've uh, taken the uh, cotton, I've expanded it out to... I've invested all that into the... So, gonna be making more there. I've fertilized the, more of the hops. The golden rods and the coffee haven't changed in size, but... That's really about it there, so... What I'm planning on doing here for the board bases, I'm going to do... First, I need to fix this up, which isn't a big... That's not a big deal to me. Oh, there goes the ladders. Oh, well. Not too, not too upset over that. Oh, there's a zombie body here. Let me just carve this up real quick. As I was saying, is like my plan is I want to reinforce the uh, the outside of this, so it's basically uh, making a, uh, and I want to dig the pit a little bit deeper for this. Uh, so I just gotta get rid of the spikes down here. Come on, you! I also think I should use a stone axe because it swings so fast. Oh, hi Penny, how we doing? You're not getting bullets. Ow, please don't. Appreciate you wanting to give advice on my base, but I don't need it, sweetie. But yeah, I'm wanting to dig the... dig the base down at least a little bit deeper, just to give it a bit more, uh... how do you say, uh... There's just a lot of zombies to fall a little bit more. So, let's, I'm going to start time lapsing this too, and uh, I'll let you know uh, the progress we have uh, once night time comes. As you can see, I haven't gotten that much process and progress done, but I wanted to focus on getting the center tower squared up first before I do the rest of the digging on this, so... Not too much progress, but I'm gonna work through the night on this for you guys, that way you don't have to work through it. I'm not gonna time-lapse it for you guys, I think it's already been time-lapse enough. But, let's just... Before I go any further on upgrading that stuff, I want to just give you guys the, the total for the episode on the on uh, the progress. So, give me one second here. I did get another two dukes from a zombie, so we are at forty-five thousand and seventy dukes uh, for the ending balance. Uh, but I think uh, that's a good up, uh, good place to end off today's episode. So. I hope you all enjoyed, and I thank you all so much uh, for watching. Have a great day, and take care.